I'm sending Justin in the house. She's trying to. I'm like, I'm fine. No, nah, he already got attitude back, <laughs> so I want to work by myself. And I'm building this bed for the twins. Um, so it's got to be unique. Um, we're using some of the crib parts, and we're just going to add some wood to it to make it like a, um, a twin size bed. Yeah. Yeah, so... Um, We'll see how that goes. Justin actually did like a um, 3D model on it, like of what we're going to need and how it's going to look. So hopefully we can execute what he created on the computer. Today started out like most days. Anethia has an idea, which to me means I'm going to have to do some work. So here we are in Blender designing this bunk bed uh, using existing crib pieces and with wood that we'll have to buy. And after a little tweaking, this is the final render we came up with. Yeah, hopefully it looks as good as it does on the computer. We use yeah. Blender and it's it's a good modeling program, it's free. Yeah. Yeah, so I hope it does work out. So yeah, we're just headed to Lowe's. <laughs> Shouldn't be a process. I'm sorry, I'm not driving, but I'm still watching the road. <laughs> just trust me. Ah! <laughs> but I'll see you when we get to Lowe's. Yeah, see you at Lowe's. <laughs> and Lowe's. <laughs> you see Justin we're getting all the wood that we need and I'm going to actually get the paint um, we got some paint um, to match the vanity but um, it was too dark I think so um, we're going to get it lightened up so yeah let's see how that comes out oh he already did it okay does it not look the same color It doesn't look the same color. <laughs> yeah. Where is it? This looks the same color that it was, guys. I'm assuming that this was the first one, but it still looks the same. Here we are back in the garage, and the scope of what we are undertaking hits me in the face like a brick. I have the vinyl blade on the miter saw, so I'm gonna go get the wood blade and change it out. Hey guys. Hey. This is the second day of our bunk bed project. Yeah. And we put some of it together yesterday and then we took it apart. Because that's kind of how we roll. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think the point of us putting it together is because we honestly, when we did the 3D model, we did not have dimensions. So it's like we're kind of having to figure that out on our own. Um, so I know we looked up, you know, like the size of what a twin size bed is and things like that. So we have those dimensions, but we kind of like, again, 
made this model ourselves so we don't know how big the stairs and all that so and that was my bad in blender in hindsight i could have done it to scale using the grids as if we just said with one grid equals one foot or one inch whatever but i didn't because yeah i, I didn't I know that you could do that yeah I, well i didn't think about it till like then mm -hmm. and i was like well that's obvious it could have been done yeah but so yeah but here we are so yeah. let's keep banging we'll keep yeah. going <laughs> Alright, so we're back to about where we were yesterday, a little bit farther. Yeah. And uh yeah, so this is the bed dimensions. 79 or the 70. Yeah, we did 79 by 38. 30 39 was it? Or 36. 36. So the bed is 35. Yeah, because yeah, it's a so, twin. Yeah, and it's 78 the other way. So we did 79 by 36 mm -hmm. just to give us that like, you know. The wiggle room. Yeah, e extra inch. So Yeah. Yeah. And then uh 18 inches for the stairs, and I think we're going to probably do the same for the slide. Yeah. All right. And, and we're not really sure if it's going to be 18 inches because um, or it wasn't long enough, but I think it was shy, maybe, I don't know, like a two, three inch. Yeah, I don't know. So it might be like, you know, 15, 16 inch stairs, but. Close enough for building yeah, work. Yeah, it's good. All right. <laughs> Okay, so we're finishing up on day two, and this is about what we got. It's, yeah. uh, it's looking so pretty close to what we, what we planned so far. A little bit of things have been different. We're close to the model. I mean, what do you think, man? Yeah, um, we had to get about as good as we can get because it was hard without the scaling, so. Yeah. But it's coming along. We got, uh, need these guys some more wood and some L brackets, and then I think we'll be. Maybe finishing up in the next couple of days. Okay, so this is day three of the bump bed project. And yeah, and I'm sending Justin in the house. She's trying to. I'm like, I'm fine. No, nah, he already got attitude back, <laughs> so I want to work by myself. Um, yeah, day three, um, and we got a messy area. We need to clean this up, but yeah. Hopefully today, this will be the end of the wood part, and then just sanding and painting. Hopefully, and hopefully the last project for a little bit. We'll see. Cause. Justin doesn't like to do anything right. when it comes to pressure. Too thick, we don't have screws long enough, so we're just gonna put an oh, angle bracket and do it that way. I need to just drop it. I got it.
I just finished up the first step and Aniki came out and said it looks great. And then 10 seconds later she said we're completely redoing it. No. So we're completely redoing it. That's not true. It's exactly what happened. Huh, show my logic. It's better. Her so is better. He was using this piece and this piece in order to get the front part and the back part on. And I'm like, why do that when you can just use one piece? And I'll tell you why, because yesterday that was the plan that we had established. That, no, yesterday that was the plan that we talked about, but we didn't really set it in its own, but we did our measurements or whatever. And he was doing a measurement, something different, which would have made our last step shorter. And I was like, why didn't you change that? And he's like, oh, you came out here and changed everything. And I'm like, no, you actually changed the plan from yesterday. Okay. So. It's no matter. Whatever. Here's the stairs finished. Anethium did them last night by herself. She did a great job. Oh, thank you, baby. The way I was trying to do it was really stupid, so she came up with a much better way. So yeah, now we're gonna take it all apart and take it upstairs and put it in the bedroom. <laughs> so. All right, guys, so here's the finished product. Pretty yeah. much, we still got a little bit to do, I think, but uh, pretty much this is it. Yeah, only thing I have left, I just have to like pretty much do the trim at the top to kind of connect it all around. Um, I don't know what trim I'm using yet, so that will be later. Um, but here's the finished product. And we didn't put the slot on due to space, but we might add one in the future on the front. But we'll Maybe. see. Yeah. yeah. But if you, uh, if you like the video, please give us a thumbs up, it helps a lot. And uh, you subscribe to the channel, talk to us in the comments, we'll talk back to you. Yeah. And uh, yeah.